Oh, Luke, your tank is so beautiful. Look how clean and pristine it looked. Oh, yeah? Well, guess what looked like just 24 hours ago? Oh, my gosh. It's so gross. It's so disgusting. How did I get my tank looking like this to looking like this? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how I did it. Okay, now that you've seen Clarence choke on a plant for probably the 50th time, uh, let's get started cleaning this tank. The first thing I had to do was get the plants out of there, then I had to get the filters out of there into a separate bucket. Uh, people always ask me, why do you clean the filters in a separate bucket with some of the tank water uh, instead of cleaning it you know, with some fresh water? The beneficial bacteria, guys, you got to use tank water. Um, there's even some people that have had fish for a couple of years and they'll be like, oh, I use fresh water when I clean it. Uh, but then they'll also tell me, you know, my fish die really often. Do not use fresh water when you clean your filters. Use that beautiful water from the tank. Oh, look who it is. It's little Popeye. Little Popeye the Sailor Man. Why don't I scoop you up, little Popeye? Where are you going? Okay, then the next thing you got to do is you got to we gotta remove the algae. You know... I could leave this algae here. I don't need to remove this algae. Um, but I will say it looks absolutely disgusting. It, it doesn't look good. Even though it really does not affect the health of the tank, in fact, it's, it is kind of good to have a little algae to give your goldfish something to nibble on. Um, I will say aesthetically wise, and also to a degree once it kind of falls off and clogs up the filters a little bit, um, it's better just to get it out of there. You know, this is, this is too much algae. I'll admit... I did not clean this tank for months, and even though you know Jacqueline's having a great time going around eating this algae, um, this is only because I just removed it and it's free floating, and you know they'll they'll eat anything. And also, look, look at Popeye right here. Look at the dude. <laughs> um, yeah, this algae had to be removed. Uh, after I scraped it up, I tried to suck up as much as possible. Um, it just it made the tank look so gross, and you can't really enjoy fish keeping that well if you can't see your fish. And they might be asking. Why did you let the algae grow so much? Well, for those of you that don't know, I just finished my chemical engineering degree. And the last semester of chemical engineering is probably the hardest thing you can ever experience as a college student. They put you through the ringer. They make you do a lot of work. Um, so I just didn't have time to clean the algae. Um, and also, I started putting some sand in there. I took the sand out while I did the whole potato experiment just to kind of help things be a little bit cleaner um, but I've decided to put the sand back in because I wanted to give this place a little more you know aesthetic look after I put it back in there I had to flatten it out and you'll notice it's already looking like way cleaner uh, after I did that I had to put the plants back in there um, this was actually kind of difficult they fell into the water a couple times I didn't show that on camera uh, but it first like balancing these plants on here is very difficult but after I did all that uh, the tank was looking pretty good uh, the goldfish were happy. They were just as happy before. You know, the goldfish don't really mind a dirty looking tank, uh, but I do. <laughs> uh, but they were just as happy here. They were, you know, eating their food. They, they actually like the sand. They like to sift through the sand. Uh, but overall, I'm very happy with how this tank turned out. I think it looks very beautiful. Uh, I also decided to add this light here on the top. And I think this light really brings out their colors. If you'll see the red on Jacqueline and the red on Popeye, that red was not popping out as much before. Uh, this re this light I got from uh, JCMP Aquarium. They actually they, they sent it to me for free a while back, so I appreciate that, guys. Thank you. Uh, it really brings out the red color in these fish. And and uh, Mr. French Fry here, he's a yellow fish. He's looking orange. Mr. French Fry, the yellow fish, is looking orange because these lights are popping out the colors like crazy. Uh, I, didn't even, I didn't even think Jacqueline really had any bright red colorations until this light really popped it out of her. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And never forget to check out our merch, which we have linked down in the description. If you want to support this channel, uh, check out that merch. I really appreciate it. And, and, broccoli on the carpet. <laughs>